Please don't be afraid to stop if it's too much. What do you mean? Wh what? Okay. <laughs> what does that mean? Mods, uh, can we change the the title of the stream? Uh, not the title, the uh, game category of the stream. Is that what it's called? That's what it's called, right? I think I can do it. Yeah, I got it. Got it. I know absolutely nothing about this game except for uh, I've seen a few memes of the girl. Can I play on controller? Wait, can I play on controller? That would be amazing. We do have controller support. Amazing. UI hands on, tech speed fast, auto saves one, full screen on, run always off. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, perfect. Um, menu, cancel, interact, run. Sounds good. Lily, wait, should I read it? Am I <laughs> Do you guys prefer if I read it or just let it play? Uh. One for, for me reading stuff out loud, two for just kind of reading in, in quiet. Okay. Laylee, I don't want to. Well, I do. Just go over and... <laughs> ...to you. I thought she's your friend. Mom said you'd help me with anything. We'll get in trouble. Good morning, Ashley. Uh, as much as you love feeling sorry for yourself, it's time for a little interlude. It is titled, Find Nutrients to Not Die. Ready, set, go! Okay. <laughs> Inside the cabinets is... Nothing! Junk and unpaid bills. They cannot be eaten. I wish they could be eaten. <laughs> this is where you and your older brother pile your trash. It's already been scavenged several times, and it's truly and utterly exhausted as a food source. But wait, what's that? Got a can of tomatoes! Amazing, you should show that to your brother. I wonder what else is here. The front door won't budge. You've been locked in here for months now. Oh. Okay. Wait, I want to interact in there. Whatever, just leave it. <laughs> just leave it for now. <laughs> Your parents have fucked on this bed. You live like this? It's just some dirt. What is this? The freezer is completely empty. 
mother won't pick up no matter how many times you call. You've also tried to order food a bazillion times, but for whatever reason, the orders never arrive. Oh my god, it's white noise. How thrilling. Who wouldn't want to be stuck at home when you've got entertainment like this? A VHS player cannot be eaten. A bunch of rented movies. Their due date passed ages ago, but what can you do? Detergent. Drinking this gets more and more tempting every day. Detergent. It's a washing machine. It's a cleaning closet. Inside are various supplies, such as trash bags. <laughs> Whoosh. The balcony door is locked. Okay. And the trash lie your hopes and dreams exactly where they belong. A hoodie. You show him the tomato can. Ta-da! Not the reaction you were hoping for. <sighs> Ta-da! We're not eating that. Huh? No, that's the very last thing we have, Ashley. I think we should hold on to it a little longer. Quit your complaining. You're energetic enough to go rummaging through our trash, so clearly you're not dying yet. Huh? How did you know it was in the... Because I hid it there, away from you. I live in a den of snakes. <sighs> Don't rile me up. You're making me hungry. Do you know what would help with that, Andrew, my dear? No. Put the tomatoes away somewhere. Put them in my mouth, I will. I can see that your heart is set on this. Fine. Let's eat them, then. Screw our future selves. <laughs> Yippee! Time for you to go cook some tomatoes. Hell yeah. Let's go cook these tomatoes. <gasps> Good day. Are you still alive in there? <sighs> Hello. If you won't make a sound, I'll assume you're dead. And I don't bring food for the dead. You don't bring it for the living either. <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Still alive. And don't blame me for deliver for the delivery guys screwing up. Can't you go grab something from the store for us? Nah, not my job. I'll check in on you again later. Bye. No, wait. Wait, wait, come back! He doesn't. God damn it. Okay. Food time. You boil the canned tomatoes to make a delicious boiled canned tomatoes. There's even a little bit of pepper left to season it with. <laughs> this is some gourmet stuff right here. No salt, though. You used all of it to spike your water in order to avoid overhydrating yourself while drinking to fill your stomach. Well, how was it? At this point, you could feed me a can of worms, and I'd say it's the best thing I ever ate. Guess it up. No, I'm saying that's how hungry I am. It is in that moment that an ominous audio assaults your eardrums. Are you kidding me? The neighbor's at it again? Wanna go take a peek? No. But I'll come along if you do. Here, catch. Got balcony key! So we can... We can go to the balcony! Unlock the balcony door. ashtray there are no cigarettes left to smoke but it's still in good, good it's still good for bashing things in hmm can't really see squat from here you contemplate if you should take a leap of faith towards the neighbor's balcony it's only the fourth floor ashley don't you even think about it 
<sighs> He's no fun. Guess you'll have to f set something up to cross. You can't cross this as it is. Okay. Um, a chair? No. Hmm. What should we use? Do you think we could use the rug? <laughs> yeah. The freezer? Empty freezer. Oh, we could use... Got a wooden plank. Nice. Okay. She was about to pick up the whole freezer. Yeah, dude. She's interested. <laughs> Set down the wooden plank. I, I seriously thought we were going to fall. <laughs> the boxes are full of useless junk. Oh shit, okay! <laughs> Ooh, demons from hell! Wait, hold on. Ooh, demons from hell! Hear my plea! Oh, the unholy ones! I come seeking your advice! <laughs> God damn it. What am I doing wrong? I thought that was perfect. I knew I should have killed that guy when I had the chance. Uh. What do you make of this? Oh, what do you make of that? Everybody needs a hobby, I guess. Forget this. Isn't it almost time they let us watch TV? Bothering your satanic neighbor seems to be a bad idea. <laughs> Bothering your satanic neighbor seems to be a bad idea. Ah, uh, the remote's dead. Just push the buttons on the TV. Ah, uh, what a pain. Fine, I'll fetch some batteries for you. I always have to do everything around here. Yeah, yeah, what was you? It is. I need batteries. Uh. Where would the batteries be? Uh. Just some dirt. Oh. <laughs> Detergent. Washing machine. Maybe, maybe, a mop. A cleaning closet. A broomstick. A witch's hat. A cauldron. Uh, it's me. I'm your satanic neighbor. Fur. <laughs> Stop summoning demons, Fur. Coffee machine sits alone, sad and abandoned. There are only so many times you can brew the same grounds. No more coffee in this house. Okay, battery. Battery. There's an old drawing in the drawer. It says Andy and Laylee, and the very, very quiet in all capital letters. No, sorry, it's Andy and Laylee, and the very, very quiet as your original vision clearly intended it. <laughs> your artistic abilities have not increased since. You take the batteries out of the alarm clock. I had a feeling there was a reason why it was clicking. No coffee! We're out of coffee. Here you go, big bro. <clears throat> Thank you kindly. No, praise me. Wow, amazing. You did such a bang-up job. Moy. Oh, you heaven-sent God's gift to humanity. How did life ever subsist in your absence? No one fetches the batteries like you do. I stand in awe of your very existence. <clears throat> You sit in awe. You should sit too. It's starting. Thank you for tuning in. Today, we share with you some joyous developments in regards to the tainted water situation. We're happy to announce that all apartments to which the tainted water had been delivered have been secured. Wait, what the fuck does that mean? It has been three months since the first incident was discovered and the death toll is now at a comfy 53 total. Woo! I can't hear you cheering, chat! 
Let's go! No biggie. And the quarantine period for those who are at risk has been extended by another two weeks. Again? And to our friends in quarantine, thank you for keeping your disgusting parasite infested bodies far, far away from me. Sorry, it, thank you for your continued consideration to the public safety. That's all for today. Cheers. I'm going to bed. You decide to do the same. Oh. Wait, mom, where are you going? Me and your father will be staying at a hotel for a bit. I thought they said we should stay at home until... I didn't drink anything. Mom. Not booze, not dirty contaminated water, nothing. The only thing I've drank is some orange juice from a carton. Anyway, I'm gonna miss my bus. You and Andrew can join us later. Alright, this won't hurt a bit. The nurse sticks a needle in you. It hurts like a motherfucker. There we go. And now you. How long do we have to stay home? The results for your blood work will be done tomorrow. So if everything is well, you're free to come and go as you please after that. And if not, then you'll get to see what happens if not. <laughs> That's all for now. Take care. Stop calling me, Ashley, please. If you need something, ask the workers there. I can't do anything for you. And I don't want to hear these lies about starving anymore. Why the hell would I lie about this? Listen, this new apartment is a bit of a fixer-upper, so I'm really busy. Besides, isn't Andrew there with you? What do you need to pass- What do you need me- What do you need me to pacify you for? You get to laze around all day doing nothing. I don't know what you've got to complain about that. Anyway, I've got to go. Please don't call anymore. I won't answer. G goodbye Ashley. I'm sorry. <sighs> Yeesh. After reminiscing all night, you wake up, as one does. Instead of ruminating upon your misery, you decide to clean the house up a little bit. <laughs> can I sleep in can I sleep with you, big bro? Uh, uh. Yeah, why is he sleeping backwards? Picked up some laundry. Oh. You're cleaning? What a waste of energy. You're a waste of energy. Thanks. Just don't overdo it. Picked up some laundry! Picked up some laundry! Come to think of it, do we even have any detergent left? We do. I checked. I almost drank it. <laughs> Andrew is too exhausted to chat. I see we put the batteries back in the clock. You're not going to get this clean with your bare hands. Okay, well, let's put the laundry in the... in the... Boop. Oh, can I not? Got detergent! You run the laundry. Now what else could you clean? Got a mop. Tide Pods sure do look yummy. Mop some dirt. Mop some dirt. Mop some dirt. Let me guess. Mop some dirt. What else is there to take care of? The trash? I guess I can't do the trash. Oh, there's the books. I could do the books. Clean up some books. Clean up some books. Clean up some books. You returned all the books to the shelf. Ugh. <sighs> You're feeling dizzy. Uh. <laughs> Damn it, Ashley. I told you not to overdo it. Uh -huh. Good news once again. Some of you may have heard from your loved ones that there's been a supply. There's been supply shortages in quarantine households. Well, boy, are we pleased to announce that all of that <laughs> has been taken care of. It has? Does it look like I'm eating right now? Uh. 
on that note, we'd like to remind all of you not to enter the contaminated apartments. No, your friends don't need anything from you. Everything is taken care of. Should you still feel the urge to help, the staff will be administrating bullets directly into your brain as a thank you. I hope that clears things up a bit. Moving on to our next story, a brand new art museum will be... You drift back into unconsciousness. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> what is happening here? Yay, free bullets. You're too tired to get the phone. Hello? Of course. What is it? The shift in tone of his voice makes you strain your ears. No, no, go ahead. Someone is talking on the other end of the line, but you can't make out the words. They sound more and more upset as they talk, though. Well, that's... I mean, I can't do anything about that. Or I can try talking to her, but... No, I mean, yes, but that doesn't... No, I'm not angry, I'm just... No, I... Can you let me talk? The voice on the other end must have said no. It's increasingly loud, but you still can't make out all the words. Always about... You don't... Lee, Ashley, M. I had the time to think. Just can't anymore. So that's it then. Now it's quiet on both ends. Well, alright, I guess. What else is there to say? Sorry? Although... I really don't see why I should be held accountable for... A faint beep, beep, beep of a dropped call can be heard. Ah. <sighs> Who was it? My ex-girlfriend, apparently. Ooh, she dumped you? <laughs> why is that? Why do you think? How should I know? Maybe because you're a parasite infested homebody that's apparently perma quarantined. Or because she found someone new and spent a few months, buddy. Or maybe she just didn't like you that much in the first place. Whatever you say, Ashley. <laughs> there might have been something more tactful to say. Whatever. You pretend to sleep until you really fall asleep again. <laughs> Now you've been out for <laughs> who knows how long. You figure you should check on your brother. He's not on the balcony, is he? What you doing? What you... What you doing? <laughs> Someone from your apartment is getting hauled into an ambulance. Hey! Me too! People are yelling from their windows and balconies. I need some help too! Please, please, I'm starving! Soon the ambulance leaves in a hurry. Call me surprised. They actually got that person some help. I figured they just let her die. Maybe she did die. She wasn't moving. As if they'd have their sirens blaring for a corpse. Then what do you suppose was their emergency? No idea. Nobody showed up when you fainted. Well, did you call for anyone? What do you think, dumbass? Uh, I don't know. Maybe she went into labor or something. Yeah, maybe. <sighs> think they'd bring me food if I got pre- No. Nope. <laughs> Let me finish. <laughs> Let me finish! <laughs> How would you even get pregnant in here? Well, we do have that one charming fellow right next door. Over my dead body? He seemed a little off his rocker, so who knows? He might just end you. Forget this. Well, excuse the hell out of me for exploring my options here. That woman didn't look pregnant anyway. Whatever. It was just a thought. Jackass. You'd like to go after Andrew and tell him it ain't none of his damn business anyway. But you're just too exhausted. But after sleeping for a few hours, or maybe a few days, who knows, you're fully revitalized and bursting with energy. Oh my god, she's slow. Oh no, she's slow. We have slow- Oh no! Oh 
you silly lazy bones. What day is it? How long have you been locked in your apartment now? And where the hell does Andrew get the energy to make so much noise? He's unscrewed the lock and is attempting to kick the door in. Or out, depending on your perspective. How many more times are you going to try that? It's clearly barred from the other side somehow. What else am I supposed to do? If you don't stop banging on the door, I won't be freaking... I won't be bringing you any food tonight. You won't either way. Says you. The delivery will be here in a matter of hours. But I guess you don't want anything. Ugh. Yeah, that's right. Now you better stop bang, bang, banging on the door, or next day it'll be bang it'll be me banging your head against the wall. The man's footsteps fade away. Even the narrator's sarcastic. I love the narrator. <laughs> Do you think they'll really get that that delivery today? Like, I didn't fuck this up for us, did I? Unlikely. So, I guess we'll see. And see you did. That absolutely nothing was delivered. Uh, talk about something. I got nothing. Try. So. Parasites. <laughs> Parasites. <laughs> it's been a few months. Are you feeling anything? Hunger. You'd think something would be happening to us by now, but I haven't noticed anything. That nurse never came back either. Like, don't you want to monitor us? <sighs> Who cares? Me, Ashley. I care. Well, I don't. Care nor care that you care. Aside from the starving, it's not so bad here. Come again? Aside from the starving, I like it here. Well, I don't. I want to jump off the balcony. Ooh, I'll race you. <laughs> no, seriously, let's go. Let's not, though I appreciate your eagerness to join me. But it's a bit too romantic, so I'll pass. Excuse me? What, you don't see it? Just imagine hitting the ground together. And with such force, our bodies turn into a pile of gory mush, never to be separated. Our remains would get so tangled up, they'd have to bury us together in the same coffin. Might as well. We've been confined together in this coffin of an apartment for what feels like an eternity already. That was pretty hot. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty hot. I'm not jumping off the balcony with you. Get your head checked. I should get my head checked? And no wonder your girlfriend dumped you, if those are your plans for romance. Not romance, I said romantic, they're not the same thing. Romantic just means something is... The neighbor starts blasting his favorite ritual music for all to hear. Again? I wish he'd just... Oh. <laughs> oh! Oh no! <laughs> Are they siblings? Yeah. I think they're twins. You feel like you should check up on that. My lord, you've come! And you're, uh, a little smaller than I imagined. I love it! It's better than I imagined! That's all I meant! much to give right now but if you help me get out of here I can get you anything you wish 
Is... Is that... Is that no good? As you wish, humans. My... My lord, thank you, thank you! Perish! Darkness clouds your vision, and you cannot see what's happening. By the time your vision returns, the entity has vanished. On the ground lay the lifeless body of the cultist. Uh... Uh... Mm. So, uh... Am I already delirious, or didn't you see that too? Do we, uh... Do you want to check on him? Well, at the very least, I want to turn off that CD player. That's what you're concerned about? I'm not listening to this for the rest of my life, Andrew. You make it sound like we're gonna die any day now. Well, aren't we? Well, I'm not. There's gotta be something this guy has that we can eat. Oh, burglary time. Sh shut up and let's get in there. OMG, who is Ashley? She's gorgeous. She's taken by her brother. <laughs> the doorknob taunts you from the other side of the glass. I have, I have an idea. Mr. Krabs, I have an idea. Door unlocked. <laughs> Turn this fucking music off. All right. <laughs> That's a lot of meat, you think to yourself. What? Out loud, apparently. Though, I mean, is it still illegal if we didn't kill the guy? Is what illegal? Well, you know. Oh, you want to eat him? It, isn't that what you were insinuating? No, I was just making an observation. Uh, but we can't. If we do eat him, then that's it for us. There's no way we wouldn't get caught once it, they finally let us out. But it's not like we killed the guy. I think just messing with the corpse is a crime, too. Well, I think they should look past it, given that there's nothing else to eat. Will the staff here admit that they didn't give us food, though? And before that, you're really going to tell them a demon killed him? Really? That'll fly. Listen, you're overthinking the hell out of this. Are we doing this or not? <sighs> Andrew, I'm expecting an answer. Uh, um, y yeah. All right, then. Let's find something to butcher him with. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, look. A machete. Got a cleaver. Time for omnoms. So, you get the arms. I'll handle the legs. First, you chop off. <laughs> First, you chop off the cultists. One for right arm, two for left arm. One! One! Right arm! Right arm! <laughs> Next up! Left arm! We can't carry him out in the open like this. Just be quick about it. No! Can't you go get some plastic baths or something? I'll take care of the rest in the meanwhile, I guess. I'm counting on you, Andy. Don't call me that. You hand him the cleaver. Andrew must chop, chop, chop the rest. Can I turn the music? No, okay. <laughs> it's a nasty bed. Some drawers. The closet's big enough to hide him. Found 666 bucks. Nice. Both the fridge and the freezer are empty. You need to conceal this before taking it with you. Okay, I know where the bags are. Chop, 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 get butchered, get butchered, get butchered. Chop, 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 chop. Oh, they're in here. Got some plastic bags. Yippee. Left arm. 
a small problem presents itself. The plastic bags aren't big enough to fit the whole torso in them. Crap. I don't think we can cut through the spine either. Just fold them over? I don't think that's gonna work. Watch and learn. Yeah, see, if anyone happens to be looking out of their window, it'll be a disaster. Maybe if I use two bags? Listen, this isn't going to... Ta-da! <laughs> good, good god, no. D don't make me laugh at this. I don't have the power to make you do anything, Andrew. All right, all right, enough. Gather the limbs up and go. There should be plenty enough room for them in our freezer. I'll stuff the torso and head in his freezer for now. <laughs> then I'll go cook us something while you're at it. Yeah, you'll cook us quite the something. Left leg. Right leg. Right arm. Andrew said he'd deal with this. Take the limbs to the freezer before they start decaying. The sexual tension is immense! I feel it! Twins, am I right? Freezer. You place the severed limbs in the freezer. Now, which one do you want to eat? Ooh, this is a good question. Chat, which one do we want to eat? One for left arm, two for right arm, three for left leg, four for right leg. I see several fours. I see several fours. Four, right leg, four, three, four, two. None realistically. We need a pole? I don't think we need a pole. We can just use numbers. Make a pole? All right, fine. Chat. We'll put a pole up. Moz! Get me that pole! Oh. Belmont's walking around on the ceiling. <laughs> He's flooring. He seems much more comfortable now. Limb, do we eat? Woo! <laughs> the freshest one? Which one's the freshest? Oh, you mean like the one that got cut last? I don't know which one was the last cut. I feel like. It was probably one of the legs. Was he a righty or a lefty? Probably a righty. Also, the better meat is the one that was <laughs> bled the most. Listen, we don't have that information. <laughs> She's just a silly 22 year old girl. <laughs> now this is my kind of pull. <laughs> So, totally right leg. God, this poll is gonna last forever. Oh no, alright, like, eight votes for right leg so far. That's, that's pretty much confirmation that we're eating right leg. I feel like if I had to eat someone, hands are so like, I don't know, like hands are so like intelligent creature, like, I, I'd rather eat a leg than a hand, I think. Like, I'd rather have... I don't, I don't know how I feel about eating a hand. Legs have way more, way more meat. Well, that's good to know. I just mean like, it weird me out a little bit less if I was eating a leg compared to an arm. I feel like arms probably do have less meat. Hmm. All right, it looks like we're going for the right leg. You guys can close the, close the pole. I didn't want to do a poll because I knew the timer would run for like ever. <laughs> Let me. Right leg. All right, time to cook. How do I cook leg? You fry some meat. <laughs> Dinner's ready. Right. So. What are we having here? Your deliciousness is what? <laughs> Eat up. You first. <laughs> huh? 
What? Oh, you already... Okay. Eat, Andrew. You will not waste this. Um, r right. Andrew takes a bite out of your cooking. <laughs> I don't think he likes it. He begins retching. No, you don't. <laughs> Swallow. All of it. <laughs> well, well, how was that? It's... God, I hate picky eaters. I made this with love. So you're not leaving the table before you've licked the plate clean. Quit your nagging, woman. Then quit your gagging, you big baby. I'll eat it, alright? Just give me a minute. Under your watchful eye, he slowly finishes his plate. Why is why is this so hot to me? Why do I have Is there something wrong in my brain? Why <laughs> This entire situation <laughs> Yes, something is wrong with all of our brains. Good boy, I'm so proud. Just fuck off, Ashley. What an odd way to say thank you. Yeah, yeah, thanks a bunch. I'll clear the table, so leave me alone. We've got a very limited set of spices left. But what do you think I should try next? Uh, don't... I don't... No, maybe coriander? All right, I'll try that tomorrow then. I'm off to bed now. Night, night. Yeah, good night. The sexual tension. <laughs> you fall asleep, fully content with your life decisions. <laughs> Said she likes you. Who? Oh, my friend from school. Or at least I thought she was a friend. So are you going to be her boyfriend? Gross, no. <laughs> I should tell you, I, I should teach her a lesson. I should move out of Ashley's line of art site because the art is so pretty in this game. You're my brother, mine. I'll make her think twice before stealing from another woman. Oh, yeah. You're a girl, too. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Somehow you don't count as a lady in my mind. Or as a person, for that matter. Screw you! I am the most personist lady in the world. So anyway, I'm gonna take her to that old warehouse and lock her in one of the crates. Yeah, yeah. Seriously! Mom gave me some money to go buy groceries. Are you coming with? Focus, Andy. Let's leave her sitting there all night. That'll show her. Let's not. <laughs> you should go ask her to hang out. She won't say no then. Lele, I don't want to. Just go over and ask her to come with you. I'll take her to the warehouse and we'll see what happens. Come on. Mom said you'd help me with anything. I thought she's your friend. Well, I thought so too. And she can be my friend again afterwards. She just needs a reminder how to do it proper. We'll get in trouble. I'll only let her out when she promises not to tell on us. Uh... Do it, Andy. I guess. Hooray! You're the best. Today's episode is titled, Andy and Lele and the Bitch in a Box. One day you'll be a bitch in a box and your friends will take turns pissing on the ground above. What do I do about these hussies around you? Where do you learn these words? The bitch is you. I'll take you out to play, and when I'm done, it's back into the box with you. I really ought to kick your ass one of these days. What is taking him? I love Lele. <laughs> This is a very Kumo type game, it is. <laughs> yeah. He wouldn't have forgotten our plans, would he? Mm. Hmm? Finally. Huh? What are you doing here? A surprise! I want to hang out too. Oh. I mean, I guess that's fine. Say, did you tell your mom you're here? 
No, why? <laughs> Just wondering. I mean, I'm surprised she let you come hang out with a boy. No way. She thinks I went to study with Julia. But why are you here, Ashley? Divine intervention. Well, what's that even mean? It means she's full of crap. Don't listen. <laughs> so, are we going inside or what? Is that allowed? <laughs> I allow it. Let's find a way in right now. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Heck yeah. What oh, hammer? Got hammer! A steel mallet. I can't really think of a way a mallet would be useful to us in this situation. I sure can. As in help us get into the warehouse? Okay, yeah. In that case, no. Uh, Lily, I don't even want to know what you had in mind. What are you guys talking about? It's nothing. Let's keep looking. Oh my god! <laughs> Okay. What's that? Why'd they nail this metal sheet thing on the wall? Looks like there's a hole behind it. Uh, perfect. Tear it open. What? I can't do that. It's okay. I won't tell anyone. As in, I literally can't do it, dumbass. Not without some tools, at least. Huh. Even though it's this flimsy. Uh, yes. I, I like smart guys over beefy ones. Who asked? <laughs> Bitch, who asked? <laughs> the drop off on the other side of the windows is too high. Though, I wouldn't mind convincing Beep. Beep. <laughs> to jump anyway. To maybe twist her ankles. Maybe break her neck. Is something wrong? Nah, but we can't go in this way. Hmm. Can I use this pallet? Use the back of the hammer to pull out the nails. Oh, okay. <laughs> wow, it sure is <laughs> kind of dusty in here. Makes me worry about my asthma. <laughs> They're gonna kill her! Lily! <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. Ooh, I know. How about some hide and seek? Uh, you're such a kid. Huh? Andy wants to play too. You do? What? Oh, yeah, sure. Let's see. Well, I mean, it's fun every once in a while. You totally wanted to play too, you child. I, I'll be it. I'm gonna count to ten. Hundred. Count to a hundred, at least. Okay, okay. One, two... Alright, let's find a good box to shove her in. You still want to do that? Of course. She said no one knows she's here. This is perfect. Lele. You promised. Now hurry up before she's done counting. We need a box. This container's already full. This crate can't be closed. Hmm. What's this? This seems like a good hiding spot. But first, let's decide which box to trap her in. Oh no. Oh no. Ooh, now this will do. There isn't any lock on it though. Well, we don't actually want to lock her in. The hell we don't. Place a stick or something between the rings. That'll keep it closed. Won't the stick just break? No, it won't. If she's hunched inside, I doubt she'll have the leverage to... Ready or not, here I come. Ah, oh, crap, she counts too fast. It wasn't that fast, really. <laughs> Let's hide. Hide. Oh no. Where do we get a stick anyway? Andy picks up whatever wooden debris is at his feet. I guess this will do. Well, what do you think? Is she pretty? The stick? No, who do you think, dumbass? Uh, she's fine, I guess. Uh. Yeah, a kid's about to die. I think a kid's about to die. Found you! <laughs> Found 
both of you. Who hides in the same spot? <laughs> Idiots. <laughs> it was my spot first. Then you're it. No way. Andy stole my spot, so he's it. Yeah, yeah, I'll go count. And he goes to count outside. <laughs> my hiding spots are the best. I know a really good one for you. Come take a look. Um, okay. Get in the box. <laughs> Get in the box. Think you'll fit in here? Seems like a bad idea. How so? I'm gonna get my clothes dirty. Oh, boo-hoo. Who cares? My mom does. She'll get mad if I... Hundred! Oh, shoot. He's coming. Hurry, hurry. Er, oh, okay. Hastily, your friend hops inside the crate. Huh? <laughs> huh? What was that? <laughs> I got you now. Blank is too weak to throw you off the lid. Funny, Ashley, let me out. There you are, Andy, you slowpoke. Hurry up, she's putting up a fight. Uh, uh, I can't, I can't breathe. Uh, uh, uh. Is she all right? <laughs> Please, I... Shut up already, you drama queen. Let her out, Lele. She's just pretending. No one's ever died from some dust. <laughs> Come on, just let her out. What? You'll believe her over me? It's not really about whether I believe her or not. Fine. You let her out then. Who cares about me anyway? <laughs> Everyone likes her better. Bet you like her better too. But everybody does. I already know. <laughs> I bet you'd rather have a girlfriend than spend time with me. Of course you would. Oh, come on. I already told you I don't. And bet... Bet you only hang out with me because mom told you to. Well, that's... I mean, maybe she did, but... It's not fair. Why does everyone like her better? I'm loud and weird and annoying and no one likes me at all. I like you better, Lele. Prove it, liar. I knew it. Maybe you'd have more friends if you weren't always so... Not even my own brother picks me over her. I knew it already. Did I not just say... La 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 la. Talk sure is cheap. God damn it. <laughs> there, are you happy now? <laughs> yes. Hmm. <laughs> Just till morning, okay? Yes, yes, you're the best. I like you the best, Andy. You hear that? You get to stay here until morning. No, please. <coughs> Ashley! Let me out, please! <coughs> Ashley, wait! Don't! <coughs> Go! Ashley, please! <laughs> Ashley, are you awake? I am now. Um, okay. What is it? That's some manipulation right there. Holy shit. <laughs> Nothing, it's just... God, what the fuck did we do? You're still on about dinner. Fine, just starve then. More for me. How are you like this? Are you out of your mind? Listen, I didn't kill the guy. So I didn't do anything wrong. You mutilated and ate a corpse. What else were we supposed to do? Call the warden and let him know he died? Ah, uh, yes. Um, sir, he summoned a demon and then died. I swear we didn't do it. Yeah? I... We wouldn't have had to admit we were there. We could have just told him to go check on the guy. Andrew, what the hell? What what the hell? Didn't we both agree on this? I could have sworn it was your suggestion in the first place. I was too hungry to think straight, okay? Now that's some bullshit. But fine, let's assume it was so. Well, what? <laughs> Thank you for the best. What do you want me to do about it? I... 
Whoosh, whoosh. There goes my magic wand. There, I've absolved all of your sense. You never took a bite now. You're welcome. Well, gee. Thanks. We'll see how that holds in the face of the law. Listen, who cares? Uh... Isn't this like some extreme circumstances stuff? Like, can't we be excused? It's the water company's fault. First they lock us in for months, then they won't even feed us. And then, is cabin fever a real thing? Maybe we can plead insanity. I don't know, Ashley. Uh... I like this game a lot. There, there, there. You know, I... I couldn't get his head off. Huh? Like, he didn't fit in the freezer proper. So I needed to chop his head off, but I couldn't cut it. His spine was too... Anyway, I just... I kind of just... Uh... Like, kept cutting around and then pulled it off. Like some... plant, I don't know. I keep thinking about it. I can't fucking sleep, Ashley. It's... Come here. I don't know what's wrong with you. How are you so unbothered? I don't know. I compartment... I compart... I compartmentalize. <laughs> ah! This is like... There's something wrong in my brain. There's something wrong in my brain. There's something... There's something wrong in my brain. This is... <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> <laughs> okay. Yeah, the writing of this game is amazing. It is amazing. I know like we compart compartmentalize that guy into different freezers. Ashley! <laughs> Andrew? What is that, Andrew? you to stop calling me that. We're not kids anymore. Why are you crying like such a baby? I'm not crying. Wow, well, uh, mommy, the big bad did the big bad me did an evil thing. You shut your whore mouth. Make me, you little bitch. Tch, forget this. Hey, Andy. Remember when we used to go on adventures? What? Andy's and Lily's quest for something or another, remember? Why bring this up? Isn't this just another one of those? I don't know. Can you just play along for now? Until we're out of this crappy situation. Then we can unpack it all later. Why not? I don't think I will, personally. But you can go to therapy. Like I could tell a therapist what I've been up to. Alright, just a thought. Let's just get out of here. Like we should have done months ago. Now that we've got food, don't you want to keep waiting until they let us out? Hell no, I don't. They'll throw us in jail right after. And I don't know which is worse. Withering in this coffin of a house or getting railed in prison. Ah, <laughs> so you want to escape not only this quarantine, but the consequences of our actions as well. Preferably, yeah. This episode is titled, Andy and Lele and the Escape from the Coffin. Yeah, whatever. I'm going to sleep now. Mm, good night. Sleep tight. I'll try. Good night. I love you, Andy. Shove that Andy junk up your ass already. Oh my god, I don't love you that much. Ugh, you make me want to kill myself. Too bad diving down the balcony is just too romantic for you. A pillow hits you in the face so hard, you say stars. <laughs> oh my god, this game! <laughs> This game! <laughs> your body has absorbed some delicious nutrients, and you're feeling mighty better today. Let's... Oh my god, is there a save? Yeah, there's a save. Okay. We're gonna save here. <laughs> this game is fire! <laughs> ah! I love this. I love their freaky little... 
murderous little incestuous little relationship. <laughs> what? It's so quirky and good. They're both so attractive. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no, hold on there, Kumo. I'm not taking it back. I'm not taking it back. <laughs> I'm not taking it back. <laughs> that's where we'll uh that's where we'll stop stream for now though. Uh this game is called The Coffin of Andy and Lele and is available on Steam right now. I I really really like it. <laughs> All right. Um, we're actually, we're going to raid someone and then I will be back later tonight. Um, a little bit later than usual, probably like 10 PM because I'm, I want to go to a fair tonight. Um, like a, like fall fair. There's going to be like a, there's going to be like a, 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 what are those things I'm scared of? Um, I'm not actually scared of them. There's going to be a Ferris wheel. I'm not actually scared of Ferris wheels, but when I lived in Germany, I lived in an area that didn't have like any ocean and if i'm in a, a certain altitude and i i don't see ocean i i kind of panic <laughs> so i was i could never go on ferris wheels back home so <laughs> fuck the release sale ended i i purchased it for 10 bucks i think and i'm enjoying it so 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 much the sea calls me yeah all right Let's find someone to raid. Also, don't forget, go check out our Uwu market drop. Go check out our Uwu market drop. We're dropping stuff all over the market. Go, go. <laughs> go. We are going to raid. Let's see. I feel like... I feel like everyone is at... TwitchCon right now. Oh, Rummy's streaming. All right, we're going to read Rummy. We're doing an art marathon. Rummy based. Based Rummy. God, I can't wait to see you play more of the story. We're going to we're going to play through the whole thing at this point. I'm enjoying it way too much. I <laughs> I feel guilty for how much I'm enjoying it. <laughs> <laughs> all right i'll see you guys later i'm gonna i'm gonna hit the raid button um a little faster than normal just because i wanted to get ready before i head out um i'll see you tonight okay <laughs> bye bye <clears throat> i love you andy